Look Outreach is underwritten by the generous support of Munter Enterprises. Family owned and operated since 1972, integrity is important as our family name is on every project. Our word is our bond. Munter Enterprises. Just built. Welcome back everyone. I have a question for you. How do you measure success? That could be a personal question, could be a professional question, but really when you come down to it, you know, where do you build the confidence to try something new, to accept a challenge, to make something work when adversity is staring you right in the face? Well, like me, I'm sure many of you who are involved in small business or work for companies that are trying to grow, Ask yourself that question every day, sometimes at three in the morning, by the way. Well, there's an organization out there called SCORE that's been around for quite a few years, but an, a resource that I'm not, I'm not exactly certain that a lot of people in our community know about in two ways, in how you can contribute to it and also how you can utilize the services. Well, sitting with me is Rich Sellers, who I first met when we were going through this whole thing about the change of government in Saratoga. <laughs> Got to know Rich really well, and lo and behold, found out that Rich is a counselor with this organization called SCORE, so I invited him in. All right, I'm going to take a breath, okay? Thanks, Jesse. <laughs> Thanks for coming in, Rich. It was good to see you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I, th it really fascinated me when I found out that you were involved with SCORE and your, and, and, the, and your sense of the organization, what the organization needs, how it benefits the community and everything else. Let's start with what is SCORE? Well, SCORE is a national organization of about 11,000 counselors and a very small headquarters that are associated with small business association or mm -hmm. administration. Right. And of the 11,000, we're all volunteers. And here in Saratoga, Warren, and Washington County, there are 15 to 18 of us who work as counselors helping small businesses either get started or get more successful. Now, in, in what you just said, to get started to be more successful, uh, what kind of resources do you offer or uh, skill sets do you supply? Well, 18 of us come from many different backgrounds. I'm particularly marketing, general management. Other people are process oriented out of uh, General Electric as an example or have run their own small businesses. Mm -hmm. We range in age literally from 25 to probably 75 and have a gamut of industry expertise. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, let's face it, part of what makes our country great is we're dreamers, oh, yeah. right? And now Rich and I share the fact that we both love marketing and you gotta be a dreamer to love <laughs> marketing. <laughs> but it, uh, you know, people will come to you with an idea, right? They wanna hatch an idea. The startups have an idea, have an industry and or a product that they really believe in. Mm -hmm. And what we do is walk them through a process and give them the discipline to come up to a decision point that they make whether or not they want to invest their time and money into a new business. Uh, you know, as anybody would, would tell you, uh, is that that's part strictly understanding the science and the math of finance, but anyone who starts a business will also tell you that it's part dream and it's part that challenge of wanting to fulfill something inside of you that makes you think that you've got a great idea. Where is that balance? Well, it better be on the side of process and uh, details. Right. Because a dream is a dream, but making it real is very difficult, and it needs commitment and resources to make that happen. If you lay it out and go through our process, many people will then be able to either self-fund it or uh, go to a bank or other financial institution to uh, raise money. We have clients who literally fund their own to get uh, loans for over $2 million. Wow. Um, obviously, there are foundational pieces here in terms of finance, in terms of marketing, in terms of business development, uh, making plans mm -hmm. and things like that. Uh, but you also need people with specific skill sets, right? We're right now, we're always looking and happy to uh, get new clients, as we call them. Uh, but we're also looking for additional counselors who might devote, let's say, six hours a week and work in teams, as well as what's called subject matter experts. People who might do a couple hours a month uh, providing individual clients 
their expertise. It could be in an industry or a technology or a particular function. Sure, it could be hospitality, could be, if you're crazy enough, media. <laughs> <laughs> Although I think you like what we do. Oh, I know? like what you do a lot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Again, he has to say that right now. He's in the, <laughs> he's in, he's in the hot seat. Yeah. Um, I guess the, the thing there is, uh, and I'm thinking about this as, as mm -hmm. a small business owner myself and somebody who lays awake on Wednesday nights wondering if you have payroll, um, there's some hard news in this as well for people. How you mentioned discipline and you mentioned process. Yeah. Man alive, it has to it, it has to be grounded in those fundamentals. How do you tell somebody, hey, I think we need to revisit this? It may not be the best idea. I think you better do this. I'd say ninety-nine percent of the time our client come to a realization that it is either a go or a no go. Wow. Very seldom would we say, hey, slow down, or we may say slow, slow down, down, sure. But very seldom would we say stop. It's up to the client to make those tough decisions. Yeah, I've got it. Um, now, you mentioned that uh, you're looking for the, this is the chicken and egg thing, I'm sure. You have a bunch of clients. I, I know about you. As soon as I was talking to Rich about Score, I thought to myself, my God, I need the services. <laughs> you know, I'm an established entrepreneur yeah. in a way, but not without any of those. Uh, concerns about yeah. growing and growing pains, yeah. you know? So you need clients and you need counselors. Yes. But right now, you know, the, the thing that strikes me is, is the counselors. Well, we're always uh, looking for counselors. We currently go from 25 years old to maybe 75 yeah. and wide range of backgrounds. But we're particularly interested in people who would like to give back, who have business expertise, who would like to wa walk other people through how they got started or from a large corporation, the processes they used. You know what, uh, I'm sure a lot of people in my age group would relate to this. You spend your whole life uh, learning by being in the field where the challenges are, where the uh, obstacles are, mm -hmm. how to get around them, how to understand them, how to learn from them. And a lot of that reward, honest to God, Rich, is a sense you get to one point and you think, oh, I recognize that in somebody else, I'd love to help. Oh. It's a great uh, feeling to give back. This is how uh, we vo uh, volunteers uh, get motivated. We also keep up to date on whatever our specialties are and meet a wonderful group of people. This last year, we've helped uh, uh, more than 200 different uh, businesses mm -hmm. and had more than 1,000 meetings face-to-face -face with them. Oh, okay. Uh, so listen, you're out there, you're watching this, and you're thinking to yourself, you're a business that could use the services. Uh, go to score.org. It's part of the SBA, Small Business Administration's website. It, put in Saratoga or whatever, you'll find them. Um, and also, if you're out there, uh, you've been in the business world, you're thinking about retiring, you've got more time on your hands, these small dreamers, these small entrepreneurs really do need your help, your advice, and your experience. And, uh, oh, what a great organization, Rich. First class. First class. Well, thank you for coming in. It's great My to pleasure, see you as, as always. And it's a real, it's really great to get to know you too. So uh, thanks for coming in. Go to score.org. And uh, if you're a counselor, volunteer your time. And if you're a business, it's a great resource tool. All right, Rich, good to see you. Happy good to see you again. To you. Thanks. See this interview again. You can head to our website, looktvonline.com.